Members of the Utah Air National Guard have witnessed a change in leadership with the retirement of Brigadier General Wayne e. Lee. In his final command address, General Lee thanked Utah's airmen. Thank you for my last 18 months in uniform and the fact that they are the greatest that I will have experienced in nearly a four decade span. General Lee served as the Assistant Adjutant General for Air, commander of the Utah Air National Guard. Major General Brian L. Tarbett, Utah's Adjutant General, conducted the change of command ceremony at the Utah Air National Guard base on December 3, 2011. During the ceremony, General Lee relinquished command of the Utah Air National Guard to General Tarbett. General Tarbett then presented the command represented by a flag to incoming Brigadier General David R. Fountain. Utah Governor Gary R. Herbert also attended the ceremony and noted the significance of the event. I think it's a significant occasion as we congratulate uh, General Lee on his great service uh, for what he's done and accomplished and the example set for all of us. I welcome the War General Fountain because he's now assuming the command here. I have made a commitment to the TAG and I'm now making the same commitment to all of you that we will work diligently to ensure all levels of government the major commands, the combatant commands, they fully understand what the Utah Air National Guard brings to bear. Reporting for the 151st Air Refueling Wing Public Affairs, I'm Staff Sergeant Michael Madsen.